We are at Universal City Walk trying one of their new restaurants, Big Fire. There's a smoky fire grill. It's going to be epic. Why are you laughing? Hello everyone, welcome to Food Review UK. My name's MJ. Hi. And today we're at Big Fire. Let's get inside and show you what this awesome new restaurant at Universal is all about. There might be copyrighted music here, so I might have to do a voiceover. But if not, here's some information. So there's a QR code which we scanned to look at the menu. There is the menu on the screen now. Um, some awesome looking stuff on here. As I said, this is like a grilled slash smoked sort of. I wouldn't. I don't really want to call it a barbecue restaurant because it's all more about the smoking and the grilling, which sort of is barbecue, right? But. Um, yeah, there's some really awesome stuff on the menu, including like the half-fired bread, is it? Or, or the half-bread, which comes with like herb butter and peach preserves and stuff. Sounds amazing. We have ordered that, um, and we've ordered the salmon and the chicken. So let's go. So our drinks have arrived. Claire and I have gone for a selection of drinks. Uh, this is going to serve us very well because we are hot and tired. This is water, and this is delicious sweet tea. Is it nice? It's good. In fact, guys, this sweet iced tea is absolutely delicious. It's flavoured with honey. Or maybe sweetened with honey. It tastes like it's got honey in it. Really lovely. Insanely refreshing after a hot day. So this is a half-fired bread. Like a smoked bread. Crispy and pillowy, fluffy, toasted. And we got orange and peach preserve and a herb butter. So let's give this a go. It was quite noisy in the restaurant at this point, so I'll talk on the voice over here. That herb butter there, that was incredible. Absolutely jam-packed with herbs. I could taste things like rosemary and mint and basil. So there was like a really good mix in there. It was really, really interesting. There was even a slight bit of sweetness in there as well. Not sure 100% where that was coming from. Uh, with the butter, maybe, maybe a bit of maple, something like that. But it's really delicious and the marmalade i'll get onto the peach and orange marmalade well right now the orange and peach preserve is absolutely delicious it is deep and so sweet and sticky but with this really nice sharp bitterness to it a what yeah Lovely bitter element to it. I love the brilliant butter vision, literally butter vision. Um, I love the herb butter as well, it's so herby. Herbaceous, not herby, her her herbaceous. Uh, oh no, it's alright, thank you. Yeah, it's all good. Yeah, no, it's alright, thank you. Everything's good though? Yeah, lovely, thank you. Yeah, superb, thank you. So I've been tucking into the meal, but let's give it an on camera reaction. So my favourite thing about this chicken meal was the red eye gravy, I think it was called. It was really nice and smoky. There just wasn't enough of it, unfortunately. Chicken is so juicy. The smoking has really come through, especially there's some really unique stuff on here, like smoked carrots. And these smoked courgettes are gorgeous. I like the little herb dumplings, those are nice. This red red eye gravy, I think it's called, is incredible, love it. Um, yeah, it all just tastes awesome. The sort of side items on the plates were really nice as well. And Claire, you've had the salmon, haven't you? And what's that been like? Yeah, very nice. What's the sauce you've got there? I think it's supposed to be some sort of aioli. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's garlic. Garlic. Nice. So, overall, we enjoyed our meal at Big Fire. There's some really interesting stuff on the menu, like all of the different smoked items, uh, especially the, the, the sort of more unusual things, like the smoked carrots. Uh, and those extra vegetables, like I think there was like we had some sort of interesting cucumber or courgette thing, which was really nice. It was courgette actually. I don't know why I said cucumber. Well, I said cucumber because 
cucumbers and courgettes look similar but even like this bread was amazing picked up a little bit of the smoked flavor really crispy on the outside fluffy on the middle and really interesting preserve and the butter was really nice uh, the main dishes were good it's all a little bit expensive and as I said there was definitely not enough of the sauce on my one um, it was all a little bit dry as you can see you've got like dumplings on there as well as the biscuit which meant it all needed a bit more moisture really but overall it was definitely good and some really interesting stuff on the menu so we would recommend it overall